I bring you exciting news from Meta. They've just raised the bar for OpenAI, Claude, and Google by announcing three groundbreaking models in their new Llama 4 series, and there's even a hint of a fourth on the way. We can only get our hands on Llama 4 Scout and Maverick right now, with up to 109 and 400 billion parameters respectively. Meanwhile, the colossal high-capacity teacher model with 2 trillion parameters, Llama 4 Behemoth, is still in training behind the scenes at Meta's data centers. Plus, there's a mysterious mention of Llama 4 reasoning, but the details are still a secret. You'll want to stick around to the end to see what these models mean for the future of AI. Get ready to be excited about Llama 4! Llama 4 is Meta's new family of large language models, packed with amazing upgrades. One of the coolest features is its mixture of experts, or MOE, architecture. This innovative design means Llama 4 activates only the parts it needs for specific tasks, making it efficient and powerful. With this approach, we're seeing a big step towards AI models that are not only scalable, but also highly specialized. These models are an exciting step forward in Meta's plan for open-weight models. Llama 4 Scout and Maverick are already making waves in the AI community due to their open-weight nature. This means you can easily download their trained weights and experiment with them on your hardware. However, there's an important twist. Companies with over 700 million monthly active users will need to obtain a special license from Meta, and getting that license isn't guaranteed. Despite this restriction, the release of Llama 4 is still significant in open-weight models. It's worth noting that this landscape has been evolving quickly over the last few months, making it an even more thrilling time for advancements in this field. While Llama 2 and 3 greatly impacted the AI space, Llama 4 is stepping into a much busier arena. DeepSeek has made a splash with its robust reasoning skills, making it a strong contender. Meanwhile, Alibaba's Quen series has excelled in multilingual tasks and coding challenges. Not to be outdone, Google's Gemma models are also making waves by focusing on smaller and more efficient designs. And recently, OpenAI revealed its plans to launch an open-weight model, a surprising move many wouldn't have expected just a year ago. The competition is heating up, so let's see how each member of the Llama 4 lineup is doing in the arena. Allow me to introduce you to the smallest of the three models, Llama 4 Scout. But don't let its size fool you. This impressive model boasts a staggering 17 billion active parameters, all cleverly organized through 16 experts. It packs a punch with a total parameter count of 109 billion. Even more exciting is that it can operate on just a single NVIDIA H100 GPU. This is fantastic news for developers, as it means you don't need a massive server farm to get started. And here's the real shocker. Scout can handle an incredible context window of up to 10 million tokens. Wow, can you believe that? 10 million tokens are just mind-blowing. AI enthusiasts are jokingly saying it's like having unlimited context. Think about it, you could potentially input entire libraries of text or even 20 hours worth of video data. That's because the technology is natively multimodal, meaning it can process text, images, and video data at the same time. In fact, Scout performs better than previous Llama models and competitors in image-heavy tasks like VQA or visual question answering. The best part? It can handle an incredible amount of input without breaking everything into smaller pieces. While some argue that it may not deliver the best results for every single token beyond a smaller limit, the key takeaway is still impressive. This technology offers far more than the average context window, like the usual 32K or 124K tokens. Llama 4 Scout enhances performance in ways we haven't seen before. Up next is Llama 4 Maverick. Maverick has the same 17 billion active parameters as Scout, but with a staggering total of 400 billion parameters. It's also multimodal, like Llama 4 Scout, but that's not all. This model utilizes an incredible 128 experts and is based on Meta's innovative mixture of experts or MOE architecture. Here's the exciting part. Instead of activating all those experts for every single token, the model only engages a suitable subset of those experts. This clever approach boosts efficiency, reduces inference costs, and minimizes overall computing demands. Even better is that the model runs on a single H100 DGX host, but you can also deploy it with distributed inference for large-scale applications. What does that mean? It's a powerful model that outperforms competitors without needing an enormous GPU cluster. Are you enjoying the video? Then give it a thumbs up! I'd also appreciate it if you subscribe to this channel. Also, hit the notification bell so you never miss our latest updates. Now, let's get back to Llama 4 Maverick. People are raving about Maverick and how it stacks against other AI models like GPT-40, Gemini 2.0 Flash, and DeepSeek V3. 
Exciting tests from the open source community show that, compared to other models, Maverick performs exceptionally well in coding tasks and general language benchmarks. However, DeepSeek B3 might still have a slight advantage in some areas. Maverick still takes the lead because it uses only about half the active parameters as DeepSeek V3. This is exciting because it can significantly reduce both costs and processing speed. The number of active parameters is crucial since it indicates how many parameters need to be loaded or processed to generate each token. So with Maverick's approach, we're looking at a more efficient system that could save time and money. With the exciting launch of Llama 4, the team used a different approach for Llama 4 Maverick's post-training. They focused on enhancing its performance by combining lightweight supervised fine-tuning, online reinforcement learning, and direct preference optimization. Their main goal was to improve how the model handles complex prompts without making it too rigid. To achieve this, Meta decided to filter out more than 50% of the training examples that were considered easy by previous Llama models. Instead, they created a learning path including tough challenges, particularly in reasoning, coding, and multimodal tasks. This approach pushes the boundaries of what Llama 4 Maverick can do. Engineers at Meta created Maverick by using a process that involved co-distillation with Llama 4 Behemoth, Meta's much larger internal model. This clever technique improved performance significantly without increasing training costs. Meta's reported that this distillation pipeline led to impressive improvements in reasoning abilities and the quality of chat interactions. And that brings us to the star of the show. Hold on to your hats because if you thought Maverick's 17 billion active parameters were breathtaking, wait until you hear about Llama 4 Behemoth. Behemoth is Meta's largest and most powerful model to date. This powerhouse boasts a staggering 288 billion active parameters, organized through 16 experts, with a total parameter count that's around a jaw-dropping 2 trillion. That's simply massive and could enable it to beat rival models. Exciting news is going around about Behemoth. Some say it could surpass giant closed-source models like GPT 4.5 and Claude Sonnet 3.7, especially when tackling tough STEM challenges. However, it's important to note that Behemoth isn't ready just yet. It's still in the training phase. The exact release date remains a mystery, but we can hope for a swift launch, especially considering how quickly Meta rolled out Scout and Maverick. Stay tuned for updates. This could be a trendsetter. Unlike DeepSeek R1 or OpenAI's O3 model, built and optimized for multi-step chain of thought tasks, Behemoth is not a reasoning model. According to Meta, Behemoth is not designed for direct use as a product. It's a guiding teacher model for the smaller Llama 4 variants, Scout and Maverick. It'll help shape how these smaller models generate text and tackle reasoning tasks. Users could also use it to distill their models after its release. Meta is excited to share its latest Llama 4 models, and they're currently available to everyone. You can easily find them on the official Llama page on Hugging Face and some high-performance computing or HPC or AI accelerator platforms. Some tech enthusiasts have even started showcasing impressive demos using Maverick on Apple's powerful M3 Ultra Max Studio clusters. They're connecting multiple units to create large chunks of unified memory. This is particularly exciting because a mixture of experts, or MOE model, only loads the active parameters when needed, making the whole process super efficient. You can now sufficiently run advanced LLMs on small hardware. So whether you're a developer or just curious about the latest in AI, there's a lot to explore with these new models. And there you have it. The AI space is evolving at lightning speed, and with the introduction of Llama 4, we're witnessing a significant leap forward in performance and accessibility. Meta's commitment to providing scalable and open models means that developers and researchers have the tools they need to push the boundaries of what's possible in AI. Plus, with Behemoth still in training, we can only imagine the exciting advancements on the horizon as teacher models refine their capabilities. As we explore the vast potential of these technologies, I want to hear from you. Which Llama 4 model do you think stands out the most? Is it their unprecedented context length, the efficiency, multimodality, or perhaps Maverick's versatility for various tasks? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on all things AI, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Thanks for joining me today, and let's keep the conversation going about the future of AI together.